Well, there's new information tonight regarding the future of leadership inside Burley County Social Services. Here's Robert Sir with more. Burley County Social Services Interim Director Kim Osichuk will remain on the job following Monday afternoon's decision by the County Human Service Center Board. The board voted 5-2 to two not to hire an independent investigator to look into Osichuk and potential issues with County Social Services under her leadership. Commissioner Jerry Woodcox voted in favor of the investigation two weeks ago, but changed his vote Monday. The information we received in the last two weeks and the total amount of information was not enough to ask for an evaluation or investigation of the department. There were, there were complaints, but I think complaints have all been handled over the years, and uh, I, I don't think this was anything new. State Senators Aaron Oban and Dick Dever sit on the board and spearheaded the investigation efforts. Both were shocked and disappointed by the board's decision. I think the decision should have been made that we do an investigation both for the benefit of, of the county and the people it serves and also for the director. That having an objective uh, investigation done would have provided her a chance to respond to that. And all we were looking for was uh, an objective arm's length assessment. Both say the investigation was needed due to possible low employee morale, a hostile work environment, and putting profits ahead of children inside social services. Senator Oban wouldn't go on camera with me, but issued a statement in part saying the commissioner's unanimous lack of desire to have an unbiased party review that information, reaffirms their own opinion, and ignores the many concerns from community stakeholders. Also disappointed in the board was clinical psychologist Tammy Dakotu, who works with children in need and has seen the problems firsthand. This interim director has been empowered to um, to behave the way that she has behaved in the system, and and the commission has enabled that and continues to enable that. Um, I see the decision today as extremely self-serving. There is no point to any of this except to protect themselves and cover up their failures and their inadequacies. Osachuk is one of two candidates expected to be interviewed soon by the board for the new Human Service Zone director position that's currently open. She declined comment for this story. Reporting in Bismarck, Robert Sir, KX News. Osachuk was also given the opportunity by the board to take the podium and defend herself before the vote was taken and declined.